Hey, hey, we're back to Pokemon <coughs> Leaf Green. Hey. You okay? Oh, yeah, you're getting over that Just, illness that I had. It's really, it's, it's a tough one. Whatever you had was really fucking tough. It was terrible. Yeah, it must have been worse for you, because you, like, have a worse immune system than me. You're asthmatic, and you don't take vitamin C on a daily basis. I mean, I, w I, yeah, I was fighting it for a week. That, that Almost illness. a week and a half. Almost. Almost. I guess. If, I think it was just a week. Maybe uh, I guess it was a little longer. Yeah. Oh, the sailor wants to fight me. He likes feisty kids like me. That's, that's oh scary. god, stop it, game! Can you imagine if I was? Well, oh, I was gonna say, could you fuck. could you imagine if I was the female Pokemon trainer? I don't think it makes a difference in this context. I'm sorry, no. It doesn't matter like what you are. If someone says they like feisty kids when you walk into their bedroom, it's kind of scary. I like feisty kids like you. I just I thought this was the bathroom. I have pepper spray. Stranger danger! I have Proton John and I'm not afraid to use him! Sorry, it doesn't matter, like, what gender you are. It, if someone comes up to you when you're, like, 10 or 12 or 11, and and they're, like, an adult, and they start hitting on you, that's not okay. I need an adult? I, I am an adult! I <laughs> had, like, a 40-year-old man try to hit on me when I was 12 years old, and it was fucking scary. Oh, jeez. But the thing was, my grandma was there, and he chewed him out like a fucking boss. Yeah. I love my grandma. She's fantastic. I mean, out of, con out of context, that just sounds like a normal statement. I love my grandma. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Well, she was so amazing at that moment. I could have sworn she would, like, totally throw that card at that man if he got even, like, more aggressive than he was. Like, it was... She was fucking pissed. Oh, man. It was, gr it was great to see her, like, totally, like be amazing like that okay cool yeah i've had creepy experiences growing up i know yeah lots uh i haven't had as many because i am i am not a girl so yeah well i mean boys can probably have like creepy experiences too i mean i was i mean i was a subject of bullying in middle school yeah but i mean that's different and i knew some guys that had some unsettling experiences growing up when it came to the whole sexual harassment stuff mm -hmm. so i mean no yeah I it's mean... it's not just being a girl <laughs> it's just more likely when you're female because our society's fucked up but you know eh. that's eh. why you need awesome grandmas that will is that, is that something out. i can buy awesome grandmas now to awesome grandmas <laughs> <laughs> it's just like at the store, you just see like a box with an awesome grandma in it. Um, oh god, please don't say anything creeper. Even us sailors have Pokemon too! Okay, that's not creepy. Everyone in this world has Pokemon, that's, I mean, that, okay, I guess he's like, okay, but I've already fought a lot of sailors. I already know this Huey. <coughs> Where's Dewey and Louie? <coughs> Hey, at least it's not cre as creepy as the other ones. I guess that's true. That's a good thing. I can't believe they allowed lines like that in this <laughs> game. Like, yeah, but we can't have gamblers. We can have pedophiles, though. Oh, yeah. Yeah, pedophilers. <laughs> pedophilers. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's that's totally not going to damage a kid. Gambling? Oh, that's just... That's the devil. <laughs> not to say, you know, gambling doesn't have bad consequences. It's just... It's just not the devil. It, it doesn't <laughs> intentionally go out and hurt people. NCS, stop being confused. Okay, at the very least, he has not hit himself a single time. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, it's nice to not hit yourself. Alright, now he's officially <laughs> snapped out. Never even hit himself in the first place, though. So, ha 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 ha, tentacool. You guys might be able to hear it. It's actually kind of stormy outside for us. Yeah, we got some crazy, like... Is it like a typhoon that's coming towards our way? Yeah, something like that. Is that what like they call that. like hurricanes on this side of the world? Well, it's uh oh, I'm not gonna get my terminology right. I think a typhoon oh, shit. Is like a, it's a tropical storm? I don't, I don't remember. Know. Well a hurricane's a tropical storm too. I don't know. I don't I don't know my terminology well enough on that. I used to, but I haven't looked into it in a long time. Yeah, actually, we had some of our sales reps trying to figure things out. They were getting, like, tsunami confused with a hur- not hurricane, but typhoon. Which How do they I, do I mean, that? There's two- one is wind and one is water. Those are two completely different elements. They're salespeople. No, I'm oh! sorry. No, salespeople are really smart. And she has just learned wing attack. Um. That's a 60 power flying move. Nice. Oh. Sorry, I don't know my 
really yes. very well. I'm not very smart with this kind of thing. I don't really need Astonish, do I? Yeah, I'll get rid of Astonish. But no, I could see someone, like, you know, getting that kind of stuff confused if they're not familiar with it. You know, it's not part of their daily thing. NCS just got way better. That's good. NCS just became... A really, boss. Really good. All right. Cool, we're getting some good leveling on our Pokemon. Like, I was thinking about grinding before coming to the boat, but I was like, you know, there's actually a ton of trainers on the boat. That'll probably be enough training to get everyone up to 22 before Viridian, which was the plan. Uh, I probably should not have opened up with Sandshrew against water-based trainers. Oh, well. Did, 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 did I'll get to Taylor my Phillips say anything dirty? I missed out on it. Darn it! Now, are you just searching for it now? I'm searching for it Did now. Did he say something dirty? Did he say something dirty? Oh my I, gosh, all sailors say something dirty. I'd be surprised now if that rain does not happen on the recording, because it is getting really loud. I kind of want to, like, take off my coat and just go out there and drench, drench myself. You're going to go outside and get your old self drenched because it's raining men? No, just because it's raining. If it was raining men, I'd be scared to death. I'm scared to death. Like, that'd be a lot of blood everywhere and, like, body parts and dead people. Uh, okay, I'm faster, right? Because it's used Focus Energy and Leer, so that's really scary. I should have just scratched. It's using Leer again. Please kill it. Thank you. Oh, I feel so at home with this rain. I do, too. It's really funny, because, like, the kind of rain you're hearing right now is the kind of rain we grew up with. If they can hear it. If they can hear it. It's like some pretty intense rain. And, like, it's funny over in this part of where we're at right now, there's not as much intense rain like this. So people get all sorts of crazy about it, where it's like, they canceled games because of this. And I'm like, I remember having to run in track and field in this weather. Yeah. And when you're running in track and field, you don't got anything warm. Because if you're, like, a poor kid... And you're just using what the school gave you. It's just a tank top and shorts and really flimsy fabric. And you gotta run in rain. Icy, cold, fucking rain. It's like rain on your game day. And that's why I like swimming, because at least every pool in the Pacific Northwest is indoors. Except for one in, um, at, like, the Evergreen High School. That pool sucked, because... They had an outdoor pool and an indoor pool. But they never used the indoor pool on cold days. Ever. That was a part of their training. It was major bullshit. I gotta switch to cockfight because this thing's got icicle spear, so ice is not very effective against uh, Go cockfight! I bet, like, a cock biting you would be very painful. Like an actual rooster like biting rooster you? Like a rooster cock. Like, and just biting you anywhere. <laughs> just biting you anywhere. Well, what about a cock bite cock biting you in the cock? <laughs> that sounds awful. That's a tongue <laughs> I don't even have a cock and that sounds awful. A cock bite cock bites in the cock. <laughs> a cock bite cock cocks his cock and bites you in the cock. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's like the Lord Farquaad thing I was telling you about, you know. Far quad, far far quad, far far quad in a quad, quad far quad, far quads in a quad. <laughs> God love the English language, people. Oh, it's so fun! It's so fun. You can do so much with it. You can do so fucking. I bet every language has got weird shit like that, though. Oh, of course it does. But like here, we're like, oh, haha, -ha, English. It's so horrible because and hard because of this. But then you got like Japanese language in Japan. Which is what both of us study. Both of us studied Japanese yeah, for a in foreign Japan, language. And they're like, oh, we're just gonna make this a common joke that everybody does. Because our language is fun. <laughs> like, they actually appreciate the weirdness of their language. Mm -hmm. It's really neat. I really want to get SSOH to 22 because I know he evolves at 22. <clears throat> and that would be really great against Surge. We really need to freshen up our Japanese language skills. Oh, we haven't studied it in forever. I think I remember more, like, verbal components than you do, and you remember more I more remember more, more of the reading and writing. Yeah, I can, like, I can... <laughs> even now, I'm pretty good at reading uh, hiragana. I just don't know what it means. So... Like, I'm like, oh, well, that says uh, hoshi. 
which I know means star, but I was just giving yeah. an example. But I was like, oh, that says this. I don't know what that means, but that's what it says. And see, for me, I'm the polar opposite, where I memorize the verbal components really well and the translations. But the written stuff just flew out my head like no tomorrow. And I think it's like part of the dyslexia thing. Well, also for, like, for just... me, um, I remember them teaching uh, in one of my education classes, you know, for, for being a teacher. I know mm -hmm. that sounds redundant, education classes. But, uh, but like how there's two different ways people visualize things. Yeah. Uh, so if you're, if you're listening, you can try this too. Uh, I'm going to tell you a word and I want you to think about it. Balloon. When I said that, most people will think of the object, yeah. a balloon. Like, they'll see, oh, I, I saw a balloon in my hand. I saw a red balloon. Whereas some people, a smaller percentage of people, see the text, the word balloon written out. Mm -hmm. I'm one of those type of people. That's probably why reading was so easy for you to pick up. Yeah, when, when, when someone explain something to me rather than seeing a scene play out in my head that way i'll just see the words being written out like someone's writing a story oh my gosh that's this that's just the way i think yeah that's really cool though because like i can't do that worth shit <laughs> right well each person's just different in one of those two aspects mm -hmm. like for me like visually like you know like the objects and stuff, like, I think, see them pretty vividly. Mm hmm And, I don't know, maybe, like, I always, like, visualize concepts and feelings and people and everything and, like, shapes and colors Ugh. and objects. Ugh. Excuse me. And stuff like that. Like, if I see, like, a per- like, if I think about a person I know, I usually kind of can, like, attribute colors to them. Based on, like, how I feel about them and how they present themselves to me. Okay. You know, it's kind of like an aura type thing, but it's not really the concept of an aura. It's just how my mind visualizes them as a person. If that makes any sense. Yeah, I get it. Like, you would be the color yellow. Kind of like sunshine or something. Oh, thanks. And I mean... <laughs> That's just that's just how, like, I envision you. Like, when I think of us meeting for the first time, my mental image of remembering that time, I see lots of yellow and lots hmm. of brightness and lots of, like, almost blindingly so, you know? <laughs> like, that's just how I visual it. Or, like, some people, like, trying to think. Say a person we know. Taylor. He's kind of like a baby blue. All right. Kind of like a really mellow blue. And it's usually with people, it's either, like, blues and oranges and reds it's really weird i don't know what it means like how my psychology yeah yeah like, like, like what's the interpretation of this yeah like, yeah yeah i i realized like one thing is that cooler colors it, to me seem to be attributed to people who are introverts versus warmer colors are attributed to people who are extroverts like our friend chloe is a red Oh, yeah, definitely. Very, very vibrant red. Like, in-your-face red. This sounds like one of those <laughs> Facebook quizzes. What color is your aura? You know, type yeah, of thing. Yeah, yeah. That's why I laugh every time, like, I see people do that. Because, like, they do it and it either matches how I see them or, like, it's totally the opposite. Yeah. I think I've taken two of those. One said mine was white and one said mine was orange. Okay. Which is close to yellow if you mix them. Yeah. I've never taken color quizzes like that before. I find some of those Facebook quizzes amusing sometimes. They're amusing. Yeah, it's like, don't take them seriously. Just do it because it's fun. Yeah, exactly. You know? What? SSOH uh, PKC oh, is evolving. This is one of those evolutions that I'm actually not fond of. Really? You don't like Sand Slash? No, I love Sand True way more. Oh, I think Sand Slash is so cool looking. The problem, the thing is, this is, I think, the most I've ever used of a Sand True or Sand Slash. I never thought they were that interesting. Slash um, Saiyan. But, I mean, hey, Nuzlocke, you don't have a choice, and uh, Seamus is going to be really good for us against Lieutenant Surge. I still, I love that name. What, Seamus? No, Lieutenant Surge. Oh, right, right. Well, you'll get to see him soon enough. He's basically Guile from Street Fighter. Nice. Yeah. Okay, I'm trying to see what I'm missing shading wise in this. I think I'm almost done. Oh, look, uh, he has a photo of a, a Snorlax. Oh, that's cute. 
We're getting pretty close to the rival battle. I, I don't want to actually activate it yet. I'm gonna fight these people first. Check out what I fished up! Alright, NCS, it's time for us to use your new <coughs> ultimate wing attack attack. Yeah, those fishers look like perpetually annoyed. <laughs> yeah, they're like, hey, you're bugging me. I'm trying also, to fish here. Why are they fishing inside the boat? <laughs> what are they fishing? I think to they've catch? carved like a hole at the bottom. Which is very dangerous. <laughs> Probably shouldn't carve a hole at the bottom of a boat. Okay, look at this. NCS can, like, two-shot things now. It's not this whole ritual where, like, I'm confusing things and then rapidly stunning him with a bite. You're just like, hey, what's up? I'm a bat. Whoa, bam Tornadoes! Oh, bat motherfucker. <laughs> I'm Batman. <laughs> that line in that, like, tone of voice comes up every fucking time I watch Gotham and little Bruce Wayne comes up. Because <laughs> we've, we've been watching like, Gotham recently. We've been really watching a lot of it. Because, like, I don't know, I've always been interested in it. And I like the Batman, like, world mm -hmm. a lot. I'm not a big fan of it. I don't know everything, but I just like the concept. Oh, yeah. And the focus on the villains. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, no. Uh -oh. What's going on? Uh-oh. Oh, oh he's, he's poisoning you. I really don't want to, um switch because I wanted to get all the XP from this because I know he'll evolve two at the next level. Oh, man. So I'm going to heal him. I haven't used one of my potions in a while. Alright. But yeah, we've been watching um, Gotham and every time, like, Bruce Wayne, like, his scenes show up and, like, he gets kind of, like, defiant and rebellious because he's a little, like, teenager kid. I'm, like, always thinking, like... I'm Batman. I'm Batman. <laughs> I'm going to do this because I'm Batman. Batman. I'm gonna solve my parents' crime because I'm Batman! Yeah! It's like, it's so funny. It's really great. Oh, yeah, I'm pretty Thank sure that. this is when Zubat's evolved. Yes! More evolutions! We're getting to that point where, like, everybody's evolving. The only one I know it's gonna take a while is Mankey. <laughs> Jigglypuff's up to us. We could evolve Proton John whenever we feel like this it. This is another evolution I don't like. Oh, and once again, I love gold bats. I love gold bats. Look at that. Ah! <laughs> so stupid! Hey! I'm ready to fight! They look really bad in the 3D version, though. Okay, like, wait, wait, at least, like... wait, Rosie. Ready? Ready? Yeah. In the bathroom! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's so fitting. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, no, I just... I don't like, like, large open mouths. I don't at all. They make me think they're mouth breathers, and I just... I can't stand mouth breathing. Okay. Okay. I don't like the look of it. Okay. I just, I, it drives me fucking nuts. It makes me want to just like pop someone's jaw back up. Be like, Jeff. fucking don't do that. Breathe through your nose. Um, this is the wrong matchup. Ha <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, <laughs> well, he's high enough level, but we're going to send out SSOH anyway. Oh, man. Just to be careful. That Pikachu's going to fuck you up. Yeah, it's level 23. I ain't dealing with that shit. I'm just gonna have Seamus destroy it. Uh oh, this one's high enough level to no quick attack. Damn. It could eventually kill me if it hits me with fifth, with eleven quick attacks before I hit it with one dig, which could happen because it keeps using double team. It's gonna be actually a really big pain to hit. Oh look, I hit it! Yay! Ah crap! I'm paralyzed. In new games, you can't even paralyze ground types anymore. I don't think. Oh, his name is Brooks? Yo, -ho -ho! good match. I feel young again. All right. Forever young. Oh, hey, we're out of time this episode. Next time, we'll probably fight B-Doof. Yeah. <laughs> so I'll see you guys next time.